Some Mayport Middle School students are showing what it means to be Positively Jacks. Their desire to learn and make our community a better place is earning them some big recognition. Our cameras were there today as the entire school came together to celebrate. Oh, they're right there, I think. Now look at your plankton net. Keep an eye on it. You want to keep the mouth in the water? Hands-on learning along the St. John's River. This group of Mayport Coastal Sciences Middle School students is eagerly collecting samples of microscopic plankton. So when are we going to get to go back to the lab and research this stuff? The goal? Learn from the plankton to find out how to improve the health of the St. John's River. It's an important study that's now getting national recognition. Good morning, Sharks! That's Jose Soto from State Farm bringing big news to the school's gymnasium this morning. These students are being awarded a $97,000 grant so they can continue their research. I didn't even know we were going to get this money. And now that we are, it's just amazing. Marissa Caruz serves as a project manager, and her hopes for this grant are simple. I want to see the river improve. I want to see us make a change in our community. And I'm very proud of them taking a chance to take a risk and try something they've never done before. Saying teacher Jill Sullivan is impressed by her students is an understatement. It's not every day that you get to work with students, and certainly not ones that can write a grant at 12 and 13 year olds of this caliber. It's something special the entire student body recognizes. That's why they all gathered today to say thanks. And celebrate their classmates in their own way. Now to give you an idea of why this is such a big deal, 980 schools applied for this grant. Only four schools in Florida were chosen, and Mayport Middle was the only middle school in Florida selected. Wow. And Tom, the goal is that whatever information that these children gather from their studies, they're going to share it with the St. John's Riverkeeper. A pep rally for plankton. How cool is that? You know, I grew up around the Allegheny, Monongahela, and Ohio rivers, and for years I, I lived in Washington near the Potomac River, but I have to say, they're nothing. They're creeks in my eyes compared to the St. John's. St. John's. Is Everybody something. here loves our river. I know.